I have a checkup with my surgeon today in like 30 minutes. Oh, jeez, I almost tripped over my cat. See you later, buddy. It's like a 20 minute drive and then I'm headed to the gym. We are here, time to go have a quick like 15 minute appointment with this surgeon and hopefully get some more good news. But on a good streak of good news, so I'm hoping that it's more good news. I don't know what would go wrong though. Okay, I gotta go. Oh, Jesus. Oh, oh. it's so windy. Like crazy windy outside today. That was another good doctor's appointment. Everything, it was super quick, it took me like five minutes. The surgeon said everything is going super well, and the good news is that I can start not having to wear my brace as much. She said I can start taking it off, walking around, and trying to get normal walking function back. So that's some good news, because I have been wearing this brace for over two months now, and I'm tired of it. <laughs> but okay, I have to get back to work, because I have a personal training appointment at 10.15, and it's 9.38 right now, so I gotta go. I'm at work now. Come on. Only one personal training this session. This session. Only one personal training session this morning. Then I'm gonna work out. Let's go, because I'm almost late. This is the first time I've done an exercise montage in like quite a long time. <laughs> now I gotta do physical therapy. I never thought that doing such simple little squats to a bench would be so hard. That's actually kind of tough. There's an older guy watching me right now while I'm talking to the camera. I wonder what he's thinking. <laughs> oh, there. All done with my workout, all done with physical therapy. Now I'm starving, so it's time to get back home. Like really, really hungry. I gotta come back here in like two hours too. I've eaten. And now I'm headed back to work. I gotta stop at the post office first before I go back to work for the evening. This door was just recently painted and there's no doorknob on it. I don't, <laughs> I don't know how to get out of this. Talos, don't touch the door, bro. You're gonna get all sorts of full of paint. Fingernail, fingernail. Oh, got it. Get me your bed. No, I not being kidding. Oh, okay. <laughs> hey, stop using the claws, bro. Stop using the claws. I'm all done with the post office. Now it's time to go back to work. I have only like three sessions tonight, which is pretty simple. You turning? Where the fuck are you going? 
I'm not in the best neighborhood and I don't really like it, so I'm gonna get to work now. Yesterday, I tragically dropped my toothbrush in the toilet. <laughs> So you always hear about Quip on different YouTube videos and sponsorships and advertisements. So I figured I was gonna try out Quip just because I, I wanted, I needed a new toothbrush. You know what? I'm gonna put this down because I'm not dropping another toilet brush, toilet or toothbrush inside there. Toilet brush. <laughs> oh. Yeah. All right, quit. Here we go. Do I brush? I don't know if I'm supposed to brush with it or just let it go. I feel like it's not doing enough. So for being a $25 toothbrush, it's kind of cool, but you can get a basic toothbrush and it does the same exact thing. 